today I'm gonna be doing the heatless curls where you put your thing here so I tied two long socks together I've been I already knew this I know it works because I've tried it I used to do it when I was younger um, I used to do like a lot of overheat curl over here overnight curls and like this was one of them and I know it works but I haven't done it in a long time and my hair is longer now so I'm gonna be trying to do attempting to do it to see to show you guys and just because I want to so so basically whatever I get one of these I put it on the center of my head I you split your hair in half and then um, you can use a clip to keep it in place so it doesn't move but I'm gonna try to do it without the clip okay so and then he's gonna be here bothering me so anyways try to keep it here you can Grab a clip, like I said, just grab a piece and then put it this shadow. Put it behind your sock and then bring it forward. Grab some more and put it behind your sock. Uh, bring it like, see, like under and then grab more and then bring it around and then like that. Just repeat it until all of your half of your hair is. Um, in this sock and then at the end just twirl it around like this and until you get to your end just put a hair tie in it so I'm not gonna leave it overnight I'm just gonna uh, do it till it's currently 119 and I'm gonna take them off like at five and then you can just clip it or after I'm gonna put them both together in the back but for now, that's good. And now this side. And repeat, just grab a hair, put it behind the sock and under, and then grab some more and all together grab it and over and under, and then grab more and then the same. I damped my hair, my hair a little bit, just a little bit, because I didn't want it to be that wet because then it'll, for me, I think it'll take longer to dry and then I want to take it out. I'm only going to leave it for a little bit. So also because I'm going to leave it for a little bit, um, I don't think it's going to be that curly. It might be like curl, but less, less, um, defined. But if you leave it overnight, it'll be big curls. Like really curly. But yeah, so just gather all the leftover hair. Make sure you cut everything. And then just twirl it around. Like this. Then I'm gonna go into my room and I'm gonna twist it again like this just so it's really tight, both sides. And I'm gonna grab a, a, another hair tie and pin it back so it's out of the way. So then I'm gonna take it off at four or five, no at five, and I'll show you what it looks like. Okay, so for a second I forgot that I was filming. So, um, looks ugly anyways I forgot that I was filming um, so I'm just gonna do go ahead and put it down because I'm cooking right now but um, 
I just want to show you the reveal because my fiance is on his way home and I don't want to look like this. So, anyways, you just remove everything and then you start untwirling it. You can see it works because it works. But this was just for the time. It, like right now, it is five, five, like five ten or something. Um, no, like 5.20, I think, or 5.15. But, yeah, so I only left it for a little bit of time. So if you do it overnight, it will definitely work. And it'll be, like, I don't know. I feel like it'll be, like, tighter or, like, more permanent. And then just shake it off. I'll take my glasses off. Okay, I can't see. Hold on. Okay, yep, this is what it looks like. As you can see, it completely works. Um, very curly, and then you can go ahead and style it however you want. I'm not gonna style it right now because, like I said, I'm making food, but you can really tell it works. So, this is what my hair looks like. Very voluminous. I'll show you from the back. But yeah, do it try it and i hope it helps you with your getting ready okay bye